a miracle on a Houston highway. Imagine being pulled off to the shoulder of the highway when you get a call warning you there's a car coming your way and it happened to one family. It's remarkable what happened. ABC's Kendis Gibson has more. The shocking moment caught on camera as a car careens into a tow truck at 50 miles an hour. Oh. Now we're learning the dramatic details behind the jaw-dropping crash and how the victims miraculously survived without even a scratch. It was one of the most frightening things in my entire life. 11 a.m. Sunday, a family of seven on the way to church pulls over to the shoulder of this Houston highway. We had a flat tire. 11.08 a.m., tow truck driver James Richards arrives to help. At around the same time, emergency dispatchers get an alarming phone call. Tell her emergency dispatch. An alert driver notices a car swerving across the highway. He's still moving now. Dispatchers able to see the swerving car on traffic cameras and realize it's on a collision course with that tow truck driver and the stranded family. With just moments to spare, they radio the truck driver, also a county employee. Be advised, sir, we have a possible DWI that's coming into your location. To clear the lane. Richards doesn't hesitate, pushing the family into their vehicle while he stands against a concrete wall, bracing for impact. He's just driving straight towards us. It looks like you're on a railroad and the train's coming right at you and there's nowhere to go. Describe the sound. Bone chilling. Those dispatchers still watching on their monitors and gasping. <laughs> oh, Fearing the worst. It's really terrifying. Um, because you don't know for sure whether or not your guy got out of the way. Five, ten seconds pass before they hear everyone is alive and well. This morning, the reunion between that lucky family and their heroes who saved them. Here's the guy that was uh, driving the truck. Thank you. That family still made it to church on Sunday with so many more thanks to give. For Good Morning America, Candace Gibson, ABC News, Houston. I'm sure they did make it to church on Sunday. Wow. Yeah. Had a lot to be <laughs> thankful wow. for. But and Monday. I know. But, but, but who knew all the cameras and the dispatcher calling? It's so seconds. fast. Oh, oh my gosh. So and that reckless driver told police he was texting and been up for 24 hours. Oh, oh. no excuse.